Hello, John Brownstone with Loading BDSM here, and welcome to Daddy's Desk. Today, I want to talk to you a little bit about a form of punishment um, that I've heard of and actually I had even done in the past. I uh, hear a lot about it from submissives, and basically what it is, is it is punishment by silence by punishing submissive by cutting off communication. Now, hear a lot of this more so in long distance relationships uh, where the dom and sub communicate by text or phone call, Skype, what, whatever method you may have. And when the submissive doesn't perform a task or, or do what she's supposed to, the dominant cuts off communication. Uh, that is really not an acceptable form of communication. It, it's not healthy. It's not productive. And it causes much more harm than good. It's, it's one of those things that, you know, a DS relationship is built on communication. And by cutting off the communication, you are causing the sub harm. Uh, you can, it, it can wear on their self-esteem, all right? And it, it, it's not healthy. It, it, it can do damage. You know, a, a sub has walls built up around them. And as a dominant, it's your responsibility to uh, show them the trust to let you through those walls. And by breaking off communication, you're actually making those walls thicker. It, it's not going to do anybody any good. You know, you, you need to be able to, to talk about what has happened. Uh, there's, there's a lot of other acceptable forms of punishment. Even in long distance, um, you know, whether it's taking away social media, um, having them write lines, anything like that. But, you know, taking away that, that communication, um, it can leave a submissive with a feeling of abandonment. Not good. Not good at all. So... You know, you, you, you don't want to go down that road. I made that mistake a um, long time ago. Uh, thankfully, it didn't end badly. But, you know, you, you learn from your mistakes. And it, it's just not a, a place you want to go to. You know, even now in my relationship with Kayla, um, thankfully, in, in, she's a good girl. <laughs> She does her best uh, not to um, get punishment, but um, you know, in in throughout a relationship, there have come times um, she has actually done something to make me um, angry, <laughs> believe it or not. And um, the way I've handled it, you know, anger anger is normal. Um, we are, you know, we're not super dominants. We, we get angry. It happens. Um, but, you know, don't punish out of anger. So, you know, what I will do is I will tell her, I said, look, you know, I need time to process this. Uh, let me think about this and, and we will get back to this and we will discuss it. And, and, you know, I will tell you what your punishment is going to be. But we may not talk about that particular thing right then and there, but it doesn't mean we stop talking, period. We still go about our day-to-day. -day. We, we talk, you know, if, if I'm not home, we'll text. Um, you know, life goes on. And then later in the day, once I've had time to, to think about it and process everything, we sit down and talk. Then, I will administer whatever punishment is fitting. 
Uh, you know, I've always been one to believe punishment should fit the transgression. <laughs> but um, cutting off communication is not it. That, that is not the way to go. Um, by cutting off communication, you're breaking down your sub and you want to, you want to build them up. And it, it's also detrimental to you as the big D. Um, you know, by cutting off communication, you are the one who's supposed to be in, in, in charge. And, and that's not a good way of, of being in charge. That's not a, a good way um, to prove yourself a, a solid leader. You know, don't, don't do that kind of harm to your DS relationship. Don't do that kind of harm to your relationship, period. Uh, you don't want to go, you don't want to, you don't want to do that. You, you're, the whole point of DS is to make your relationship firmer, solid, more solid. And, and, you know, cutting off communication is not the way to do it. Not the way to do it at all. So, you know, like I said, I, I had done that in the past. Um, big mistake. Learn from my mistake. Will not do that again. Have no intention. And, you know, if, if anything, that, that you take away from this um, as, a, as a big D, as a, as a little S, you know, it, it is not something that should be factored into your, into your relationship as a punishment. Uh, so many other things that you, that you can do um, that are more uh, healthy, productive, and help growth-wise for both of you. So, you know, it's the old saying, silence is golden. Um, maybe sometimes, maybe, but not for a punishment, not, not to shut the door on your sub for any amount of time. So I, I hope you found this helpful. Uh, thank you for joining me here at my desk. And as always, keep it kinky, y'all. Thank you.